uh, thinking this morning when uh, I was anticipating this, but years ago when we started another artist guild, we were trying to put together an artist cooperative, mm -hmm. which would have been for the artist. But I think now what we're looking at is something that's more for the community. A, you know, a place where we can depend on to do things with the community and tourists and locals and children all alike. Don't you think that's so? Yeah, I, I think what I've noticed in 27 years of living here mm -hmm. is that quite often we lack the infrastructure to build community in Angel Fire. Uh, we see this when music from Angel Fire has to juggle to get a space mm -hmm. for performance. We've seen it over and over again when Missoula Children's Theater has to worry about where they're going to have a performance. Uh, so, in my opinion, having a, a space that is for the arts, not just for visual arts, but for performing arts, dance, theater, music, and all the opportunities that that can afford to teach uh, everyone in the community. I think it would be a great thing for Angel Fire, and we desperately need that because of, of our lack of infrastructure for community building. And I agree, and, and actually it's a perfect time for us. We have groups, our guilds, we have established groups, we have the the Moreno Valley Arts Council, we have an art guild, we have a quilters guild, we have our children's theater. These are established entities. They're here. We're not starting from scratch with any of them. The very first thing we have to do every time we want to do anything is where are we going to do this? We run into scheduling issues. We run into too expensive. We run in not big enough, too small. <laughs> it's just a huge problem. The other thing we could do is we could have an agenda slate for the entire seasons, our seasons. We could have everything slated out, ready to go. This is what we're doing all year. Here's our seminars, here's our children's programs, our adult programs, visiting artists. It's right there. People come in town, our visitors, our summer people, our locals who are here full time. Oh look, what we've got, all this stuff is offered, it's ready to go. You know, my sister's here. Oh, look, this is what we can go and do. It's just, it, it is just a critical necessity for this area.